Well, congratulations, Dita. Uh, fantastic effort to claim your fifth Australian Open singles title. Just tell us what you were thinking after that first set and how did you turn it around? <laughs> um, I'd, I'd, I don't even really know how I managed to turn that around. Um, the first set was really just, it, it went all to UE. Like, I, I didn't even have a chance to get a game, I think. Um, so I, I try to, I was talking to my coach a little bit uh, before this, and like I tried to stay as calm as I could, but I think um, my body was showing that I wasn't calm. So even though in my head I was trying to stay calm, my body wasn't, and I tried to do that differently in the second set. Um, I managed to get into the rallies a little bit more, which uh, helped me to get this little bit more of time to get into uh, into my game, um, and I think that helped me. Did it just on that? Um, was it a combination of factors why you started slow? Was it that Kamiji started really well? She was finding her rhythm more. What was the? Um, I actually I played a, a pretty good first game. Uh, I think I even had some game points. I I don't remember. Um, but I, I told myself, you know what, okay, I didn't win this game, but it was, it was all right. Um, I can work with this. Uh, but then the second game, I remember I hit this first return and it was like five meters out the, the court. I was like, oh, okay. Um, and then I think Yui immediately, she's, she's on it and she knows and she, um, uh, yeah, she knows exactly what to do from that point. Um, so even, like I think in the third set, uh, sometimes I would not have the the most perfect ball, uh, but she wouldn't hit a winner from that. Whereas in the first set, I hit like a decent ball, and she would hit a winner from it. Um, so it was a little bit of both, I think. And you'd won going into that. You'd won twelve of the fourteen Slam finals against her. How much is that in the back of your mind when you're losing like that? It's um, it's a little bit crazy, I think, um, as a as a tennis player, or at least as being me, um, I will always be um, a little bit more like searching sometimes, like trying to get into the game, uh, trying to feel relaxed and normal. And my coach would ask me before the game, like, how, how do you feel? And I was like, yeah, I feel good. Like, I feel normal. I'm going to play this match. I know it's going to be a tough one. So I already knew this. Um, but I, I think sometimes I need to start the matches more confident and try and, um, um, I don't know, behave like the champion that sometimes my results tell me. Um, so, yeah, it's always going to be that, uh, that little bit of a thought where I know I can win. Uh, I've done it many more times before, but I need to believe in it. And uh, uh, it's funny how that sometimes works as a tennis player. It's your ninth straight major, so you're now only two off Esther and three off Shingo's all-time record of, of a winning streak. Oh. Does, is that extra motivation for this year? No. <laughs> think of that? No, I, I really try to stay away from those numbers because they, they can frighten you. Um, I think also when you only look at the numbers, you're, you're going to be disappointed when it doesn't happen, even though it's very realistic to sometimes lose. Like, it's not, um, it's not normal to, to only win matches. Um, so, yeah, I try to always just go into it and try to and feel well and feel the game. Um, I don't try and go into it and uh, think I'm, I can't lose this one. Um, so, yeah, no, I'm, uh, I'm just going to try my hardest for the next one, really. Congratulations. Uh, Yui said, she said that uh, she is now building up like a more attacking offensive tennis in order to <laughs> win against you. So did you realize that the change of her like a play style or strategy and that is what the reason that you get a little bit you know, uh, calm in the beginning of that, uh, today's match? Um, I've noticed uh, Yui changing her game over the years. Um, I always see it as a little bit of a compliment because she tries to really find a way to beat me. Um, she, she does really well in trying to change her game, finding new ways. And uh, yeah, she's been playing like this for um, 
maybe also at the US Open final, she played like this. And, uh, and after that, when I played her um, last week as well. So I know Yu is changing her game a little bit and I need to find a solution for this. Did you find that solution in the second set? Maybe? Um, I think so. Uh, I think it was also a little bit of a combination where I tried to calm down a little bit and um, not be um, um, as uh, as like hold back. So I was a little bit too calm, maybe, um, and therefore not hitting my own ball. So I tried to do that a little bit more, and then also uh, I don't know, try to feel, get into it, get one game. Thank you, everyone. Can we see a quick photo of you? Have you had some little problems with your partner? I can bring it, yeah.